Hey guys, iPod Apps Weekly here, and today I'm going to teach you how to make a bootable ISO file. And right here I have a bootable ISO file, as you can see. Um, this is open in 7-zip right now, and um, even though you can't use it, it's used to boot up uh, a computer. Uh, so it launches a CD upon boot, and it's uh, boot compatible. So I'm going to show you how to make one of those right now. What you want to do is make sure you have a CD-ROM in your CD burner, CD-DVD burner, and a start image burner. And if you don't have Image Burner, you can download it with the link in this video description. Okay, so once you get to this screen, you're going to click Write Image, File to Disk. And you're going to choose the file, which is right here. And as you can see, it says Bootable under File System. And um, that's basically it. Choose the slowest write speed. Uh, or like, um, I always choose four times because that's usually not that fast, but then not that slow. So it burns. Um, it's more accurate that way. So uh, just go ahead and you can click verify if you want, but just go ahead and hit this giant button over here and it will start the burning. And uh, once that's done, uh, you basically have a bootable disk. Go ahead and put it in your DVD drive and uh, hit the delete key and it'll, it'll boot up into the DVD. So this is useful for Linux, for bootloaders, for people who just want to play around with with uh, DVD drive booting. So yeah, so that's it. So if you like this video, please subscribe. If you have any questions, put it in the comments below. Thanks.